morning. Welcome to the class of 2021 graduation. I ask that you please remain standing and gentlemen remove your caps as we honor our country with the presentation of the colors by the Great Mills High School Navy Junior ROTC, the playing of the national anthem by the Great Mills High School School Chorus under the direction of Ms. Sarah Nelson, and the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Before we begin this morning's ceremony, I'd like to acknowledge our stage guests. Please stand when your name is called. Dr. J. Scott Smith, Superintendent of Schools. Ms. Audra Bishop, the presenter of diplomas. <laughs> Ms. Wanda Duran, assisting with the diplomas. <clears throat> Leanna Eldridge, STEM salutatorian. <clears throat> Andrea Datan, STEM valedictorian. <clears throat> Thank you. Class of 2021, welcome to what is a most unique graduation ceremony that completes a distinctive high school career. As you know, our graduation ceremony is divided into four sessions today to accommodate our graduates and their families in our limited capacity. Due to these restrictions, I am going to deliver four key, different key ideas centered on lessons during challenging times. <clears throat> These lessons will be spread out over each of the ceremonies so that in the coming weeks you can hear the entire message when the video is released. I do this as a symbolic gesture in an attempt to bring us together as a whole group one last time hoping to bridge the gaps we have felt during this past year. 
Luckily for you right now, I promise to be brief. But I would encourage you to go back and review the message in its entirety, a message centered around the four lessons learned during challenging times. Lesson number one deals with perseverance. <clears throat> the word that comes to mind when I think of the class of 2021 is perseverance. More than any other class in recent memory, you have had to persevere through a school tragedy, shooting, the challenges of virtual learning, and the disappointments of a high school life lost to a worldwide pandemic. <clears throat> During your years in high school, you have had to find a way to deal with these challenges. Challenges that I might add were no fault of your own. I can say with great pride that not only did you rise to overcome these obstacles, you found a way to achieve great success. Whether it was competing virtually in cyber patriot competitions, completing undergraduate research in place of internships, working with elementary students virtually, or participating in one of the most unique yet enjoyable proms in recent memory. Whew. Your class has made the most of these difficult situations. The ability to persevere during challenging times is invaluable. As you go through things in life, no matter who you are, your ability to respond in a positive manner will contribute to your future success. Tough times don't last. Tough people do. I encourage you to take these lessons of perseverance with you as you face the next set of obstacles that life will present. I know you can and will find a way. Failure is not an option. Each of you have already proven that through your own perseverance. On behalf of the faculty and staff of Great Mills High School, I wish you continued success. After all, we are Great
Dr. James Scott Smith has been with St. Mary's County Public Schools for over 30 years. He began as an English teacher at Leonardtown High School in 1991. He has held positions of assistant principal, principal, director, executive director, assistant superintendent, interim superintendent, and finally, superintendent. He holds a bachelor's degree in secondary English education from the State University of New York at Buffalo, a master's degree in human resources from Townsend University, and a doctorate of education from the University of Maryland at College Park. Please welcome Superintendent of Schools, Dr. James Scott Smith. Leanne, thank you very much for that introduction. I shall also be brief. Class of 2021, you're going to enter a world like no other, one that hopefully won't take for granted how special it is to gather together, to see each other's smiles, and to hug and hold loved ones. I'd like to just take a quick moment to thank each one of you for getting yourself here and for doing what it takes to probably get your friends here as well. We also need to give thanks to the teachers, the counselors, support staff, administrators, bus drivers, food service work workers, building service workers, everybody who has labored for the last year and a half to get us to today. But students, most importantly, you need to thank the people behind you who have always been behind you. Thank you to the parents and the grandparents, and the aunts, and the uncles, and the family friends, everybody who has stood up to fill gaps to get us through the last 14 months. Robert Frost wrote, the best way out is always through. And graduates, you have made it through, and you are moments away from moving on and out of Great Mills. So, to the class of 2021, the masked class, the class undaunted, the class that has marked and made history, I say congratulations and job well done. May all your days that follow be filled with family and friends and smiles, and may you hold your hugs a bit tighter and a few seconds longer because you know the cost of this greatest gift. Congratulations. <laughs>
Admiral Jesse Wilson retired from the U.S. Navy in September 2019 after 33 years of distinguished service. The culmination of his naval career was his position as a commander of Naval Surface Force Atlantic, where he was responsible for staffing, training, and equipping the 70-plus ships that make up the Atlantic fleet and the Aegis ashore sites in Romania and Poland. Prior naval positions that Admiral Wilson held include Commander of Strike or Carrier Strike Group 10, USS Dwight D. Eisenhower Carrier Strike Group, a position held during combat deployment, Commander of Destroyer Squadron 23, and Commander of the USS Higgins DDG-76. Ashore, Admiral Wilson served as the director of the Joint Integrated Air and Missile Defense Organization and was the director of the Navy Assessment Division and the Office of the Chief of Naval Operations. Jesse Wilson is a proud member of the Great Mills High School class of 1982. He, along with four other classmates from the class of 1982, attended the U.S. Naval Academy. He is also a graduate of the U.S. Naval Postgraduate School, the U.S. Naval War College, and the Navy Corporate School of Business. He is an MIT Seminar 21 Fellow. Rear Admiral Wilson is now a business executive with Raytheon Intelligence in Space, where he continues to maintain a focus on STEM education, diversity, equity, and inclusion, in addition to his many other professional responsibilities. The class of 2021 welcomes Rear Admiral Jesse Wilson into the Great Mills High School Hall of Fame. Greetings, Hornet Nation. This is Jesse Wilson from the Great Mills High School class of 1982. First off, I want to congratulate the great Great Mills High School class of 2021 for persevering through what has been the most challenging high school years in over a century. And I thank you for the honor of being inducted into the school's Hall of Fame. I look forward to joining you next year in person, and I wish you all the best and have a great summer. God bless you out here. So, hi, A through E senior graduates of 2021. Congratulations on all the achievements that you have accomplished today. These past four years have surpassed my expectations of the traditional high school experience. While we didn't have a singing and dancing basketball team like in High School Musical, I believe that enduring a global pandemic is just as peculiar. But if there's one thing that these experiences have taught me, it's that our class is one of the most resilient groups of students to face the world pulling together a dub against the class of 2020 for the spirit stick as juniors, which let's face it, is always rigged in favor of the junior senior class, to embracing a completely different style of learning in our final year, we have accepted challenges and proven that nothing is unachievable. As we enter a new chapter of our lives, I won't say something dumb like don't procrastinate your work because even I waited until last minute to write the speech. <laughs> However, the one thing I will take away from these past four years, and no, it's not anything from Calculus BC, but it is that you will always have people to support you. To the teachers that would answer my emails the night before the deadline, to the friends that would stay up until two in the morning working on their assignments with me, to the counselors that listened to me when I cried, and to my parents who pushed me to believe, achieve more than I believed I could. Regardless of who is in your life, they are one of the reasons we are graduating today. Combined with your hard work, determination, and persistence, and some other cool nouns, I know that our class is going to overcome what the world throws at us in order to achieve, produce change and achieve the greatness we have each so rightfully earned. In the words of Natasha Bedingfield, today is where your book begins, the rest is still unwritten. Yes? 
Dr. Smith, I am pleased to recommend to you these candidates for a Maryland State Diploma. I verify these candidates at receiving their diploma have met all the requirements necessary. Let the presentation of diplomas begin. Gabriela Alexandra Anaya Barraza. Ocean Sanaya Andrews. Tyler Wesley Ahrens. Erica Lynn Audi. Kaya Ann Baker. Lucas Allen Balajo. Elise Garcia Bankins. Antonio Tyrese Banks. Diego Marquette Banks. Trayon Emery Barkley. Desmond Micah Barnes. Kiasia Naishe Baznight. <laughs> Catherine Anne Marie Baxter. <laughs> Damon Rashawn Beckford. Jalen Allen Bell. <laughs> Brett Ethan Berg. <laughs> Latavia Janae Berry. Antonio Tomas Betancourt Cantu. <laughs> Ashley Taylor Bias. <laughs> Caitlin Nicole Bird.
Dylan Patrick Birmingham. Leilani Rose Bisco. Ray Antonio Bisco. John Lee Blackwell. Trinity Jade Boone. Marcus Alexander Bow. Jordan Lachey Bowers. Michaela Lynn Gabrielle Braley. Mark Andrew Gilas Britos. Ryan Lee Brookhart. Charnel Renee Brown. Ronrico Zykerion Brown. Rebecca Lynn Brown. Devin Maurice Bryan. Diamond Ashanti Bryant. Brittany Marie Birch. <laughs> Madeline Rose Burkhard. <laughs> Sharon Terrell Bush the third. Matthew John Bustle. Maria Guadalupe Cayetano Vargas. Carmen Arlene Elizabeth Cameron. Lizette Montserrat Cano. Randy Giovanni Carrillo Salguero. Katina Varee Bonds.
Leah Johnston Carroll. Sean Matthew Carson. Jeremy Scott Case. Juan Jesus Cervantes Corona. Ashanti Najay Champion. Danasia Tajane Chase. Sanai Asnet Chase. David Michael Chivaroli. <laughs> Jacob Wayne Clark. <laughs> Matthew Ian Clark. Malachi Nathaniel Claude. <laughs> Micah Emmett Clinton. <laughs> Wilfredo Coyado Jr. Alyssa Janae Collins. Cole Jarrett Congelco. Jaden Herman Alexander Cook. Moira Elizabeth Cooper. <laughs> Kyle Zachary Cox. Cameron David Lewis Curtis. Jordan Nathaniel Daly. <laughs> Daniel Evan DeShiel. <laughs> Andrea Nicole Datan.
Jaquise Davon Davis. Julia Noel Davis. Madison Ashley Davis. Malia Shawnee Davis. Ronald Lewis Davis III. Sean Patrick Davis. Victoria Bell Davis. Zachary Lee Davis. Tyler Jordan Day. Alana Nashe Dent. Rihanna Ashari Dickerson. Damon Henry Dawkins II. Elijah Tremaine Dorsey. Ayana Nashe Dorsey. Miles Everett Dorsey. William Michael Dowdy. Emily Nicole Dove. Cadence Christine Dries. Kyle Francis Dursey. James Carroll Dyson III. <laughs> Kayla Nicole Dizek. Connor Patrick Agan. (laughs) 
Leanna Jo Eldridge. Elvira Patricia Escobar Figueroa. Francisco Jose Cabrera. Wait for it. Come on. <laughs> They're teenagers, you know, it's early. <laughs> Students, please stand. By the virtue of the power vested in me by the Maryland State Board of Education and the St. Mary's County Board of Education, I now pronounce you bona fide high school graduates of the state of Maryland and Great Mills High School. As a bona fide graduate of St. Mary's County Public Schools, you are now entitled to wear the academic tassel on the left side of your mortarboard. At this time, move it over. Giddy up. <laughs> 